It's time for your Toyota Sports Report. The St. Lawrence men's lacrosse team saw their season come to an end on Sunday in the third round of the NCAA Division III men's lacrosse championships, falling to St. John Fisher 11-10. Ben Hutchinson led the Saints with five goals, while Judge Murphy added three goals in defeat. Despite the loss, another successful season for the Saints under longtime coach Mike Mahoney, who will enter the 2025 season just five wins shy of 300 career wins. In the fall of 1997, Mike Mahoney took over the men's lacrosse program at St. Lawrence, a team that he once played for. Since then, the rest is history. History that the St. Lawrence Central High School grad has rewritten. In his 27th season as the head coach of the Saints, Mahoney holds the record for career wins as men's lacrosse coach and is one of the winningest lacrosse coaches in Division III history. The 2016 Division III Coach of the Year says it's been a journey he hasn't taken for granted. You know, when you when you first get started, you try to try to put 365 days together and, and then all of a sudden a year turns into five and 10 and, and, you know, here we are kind of mid to late twenties, uh, as far as years as a head coach. And, um, you know, I, I think similar mindset, uh, as we ask of our players, let's, let's take this day by day. The seasons go by too fast to try to get too far ahead of ourselves. And, um, so let's be in the moment, enjoy the moment and, uh, you know, really appreciate every, every opportunity that we get. The Saints have won four Liberty League titles under Mahoney, and the coach has been named Liberty League Coach of the Year seven times, including this past season. How has Mahoney maintained success at St. Lawrence for over two decades? Judge Murphy, who was named Liberty League Offensive Player of the Year this season, says Mahoney is more than a coach. You know, it's really special. Like You, you step on campus and you can just you feel the love from him. He, he's it's like you're playing for a second father figure. And I think that's part of the, like I talked about the, the bond in the locker room. I think a lot of that comes like stems from him and just his passion and love for the game and love for his players. And it's really special to, to get to be a part of that. This season is the 19th season. A team coached by Mahoney has earned a postseason bid, including the 2016 team that made it to the division three semifinals. With the Saints, it's never a case of rebuild. It's always a case of reloading for another postseason run. A big reason for that, the quality of players that Mahoney recruits that excel not only on the field, but in the classroom. I mean, easily one of the best coaches I've ever had. Um, we wouldn't be in this position where we are uh, today without him, uh, without a doubt. And, um, you know, I... I Words can't explain, you know, the feeling that the guys in the locker room have for him. Um, all, all of the play that, you know, people see on the field is a direct translation from what he is and from what he preaches in the locker room. Mahoney has had the chance to coach all three of his sons at St. Lawrence, with his youngest son, Daniel, being named Liberty League Rookie of the Year this season. Mahoney says his success is due to the support from the university, his assistant coaches throughout the years, and the players. He adds he's never thought about leaving Canton or the North Country, a place he grew up and a place that has embraced him. You know, I, I'm, I'm just very fortunate. It's been a great spot for me, and uh, I wouldn't want to have done it any other any other way. And, and I don't feel like I'm on the back nine here of the – of the career either he got some got some years left years saints fans hope brings more added success to mahoney and the saints lacrosse program